So today we're gonna to be doing something a little bit different. I'm gonna show you how to make these really cute Easter cupcakes. There's literally 15,000 different ways you can make these, but this is the way I like to do them. And I'm gonna show you what you're gonna need. Start off with a box cake mix, or you can totally make your own from scratch. Some canola oil or vegetable oil. Food coloring, these are the neon colors. Twizzlers. Cupcake liners three eggs, sweetened coconut flakes, and some chocolate or any kind of egg-shaped candy, and then of course icing. So I just followed the directions on the back of the box, and then I set these cupcakes on a wire rack to cool for a really long time. And then I took some of that store-bought icing, and I put in two drops of green food coloring and one drop of blue. I have blue raspberry cupcakes. Those were already in my cabinet so I just used them and it actually worked really well it kind of camouflages nicely with the green icing it matches really well but you can use any kind that you like it's completely up to you so I'm just putting a semi thin layer of icing I don't like a ton of icing but you can use as much as you like and then I'm going to dip it into this coconut you don't have to use coconut you can just use the green icing but I like coconut and I'm going to show you how I got it to look so real so I just took about half a cup of sweetened coconut flakes and put it in a dry saucepan on medium heat and just kind of spun it around the pan till it got kind of warm and toasty. You'll be able to smell it and you'll be able to see a little bit of the color. And then I just added a bunch of food coloring. I think I ended up adding about 30 drops, both blue and green, and that just gives it this nice look of actual grass. Then I'm just going to take those egg-shaped candies and dip them in a little bit of icing and then put them on top of my cupcake. You can also use peeps or jelly beans, anything you like, just be creative. And then for the basket handle, I'm going to take a Twizzler. I ripped off the ends so that you get to the kind of the tube inside. And then I just popped a toothpick in half and stuck it inside each end. And then you just stick it down in the cupcake. And of course, you can use any kind of Twizzler you like. You really want to use the toothpicks though, otherwise they won't really stay inside the cupcake. Are those not the cutest thing you've ever seen? So that's it. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next week. Bye! Finish Gilmore Girls. I did. Are you watching it all over? It says it's the one who's seen One Tree Hill like a million times. I was just asking, and then I was going to say. It was how you implied your asking. I was just asking. It was full of judgment. <laughs> Obviously, I'm not judging. Right, please tell me you're getting this. That's Bert. <laughs> no. 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 Can I give him a piece of Twizzler? No, he ain't gonna eat it. I know. Good job. High five.